Weather forecasters are once again warning residents to be ready for some rough weather, as there's a powerful storm approaching that will bring torrential rain and gale force winds. Local authorities want to avoid the chaos of the last superstorm when a lack of preventative measures and poor conditions between city agencies and emergency services resulted in millions of dollars of damage. Hi, this is Yuri. The weather service says the storm is approaching fast, so it's time to get things moving. We need you at the Integrated Operations Center right away. Here's where we think the city's going to be hit the hardest. We could be looking at flooding down power lines, even gridlock traffic, as the storm will hit during rush hour, so we need to make sure everyone's ready. The data we've already gathered means we've been able to predict the risks, take all the necessary precautions, and share this information with all the agencies involved. Hopefully, everything goes smoothly and we can prevent a repeat of the chaos of the last superstorm. Be advised, there is an alert coming in. A woman is in labor and needs to get to the hospital fast. There's an ambulance on its way to her and we've sent the optimal route to the driver to make sure she gets there as quickly as possible. Here's a plot of the route on the map. Wait a second, new information is coming in. Strong winds and a tidal surge are causing serious flooding along the route. The ambulance won't make it through. We need an alternate route, fast. Okay, finding an unobstructed route, we can send the ambulance this way, around without losing any time. Forwarding new route to the driver now. Okay, the driver's got the new route in front of him, and we've optimized the traffic lights and route to make sure there are no delays. Let's check up on the patient. Doctors at the hospital can monitor the patient in the ambulance to advise the EMT and prepare her for arrival. Another potential route change needed. Uh, we're okay to proceed on the current route. Sensors and CCTV monitoring the storm drains indicate that we're within critical limits, so there's no need to change the routing. Well, more trouble up ahead. High winds have taken out some power lines just ahead of the hospital. But we have a drone in the area. Let's get it over there to recon the site and check if the route is still safe. Okay, the drones are on site now. Oh, that looks nasty, but there's still room for the ambulance to make it through. Proceed as advised. Doctors are saying that they're ready to receive the patient. The ambulance has arrived safely at the hospital. It was a pretty rough journey, but thanks to you guys, everything went as smoothly as it could, and mom and baby are doing well. Great work, everyone.